Hi, what up? I'm Sonnery James. I'm Ramishano. And you're watching Inter Zagreb. <laughs> I'm good, you? Really good, thank you. Your performance has just ended, it was amazing. Uh, how satisfied are you? Very satisfied, we played a lot of ultras and uh, I must say this one is I think, one of the best ultra we ever, uh, ultras we ever played, I think, around the world. It's really good. You? No, it's like, uh, it's the best one, but it was fucking amazing. <laughs> I'm telling you. No, we played a lot of uh, our own stuff, new stuff even. We couldn't even play because our label was like, no, you can't play this isn't out yet but we're like fuck it we'll play everything <laughs> yeah right we were like it was actually what it, what he says we didn't care i mean the vibe was so good and they deserved the new new track so we just changed our sets in the middle of our set we just like let's play the new music let's see how it works and now it's online everywhere people will arrest us for like months now when the music is coming out but it, it was part of the whole energy we experienced today it was really good yeah. You played the first Ultra Europe in 2013. Mm -hmm. What has changed since then? I think people got more educated, got more into uh, dance music, and you can see that um, we always stick to our sound and try to push house music as far as we, we can. And now finally we get an opportunity to show it on a big time slot, and uh, it worked. Uh, I get, people got more educated, and it's time now to bring house music, dance music to the next level. So more like diverse, and you see that it works. Yeah. I think people use uh, sunscreen. They're not burnt, so it's better. <laughs> you, you didn't see that? Amazing. It's better. <laughs> you have now been active for 10 years. Uh, yeah. Can you describe me first 10 years and what can we expect in next 10 years? Wow, it's hard to explain, uh, to, to predict the next 10 years because if you asked me 10 years ago that we should, would have a track at Armin van Buren, I would laugh in your face. So a lot can change in 10 years. Um, I think what will always stay is house music. Whatever happens with dance music, house music, the core, will always stay. And that's the basic of dance music. So all the genres together in one sound will stay. And maybe in the next 10 years, you're gonna find the new like hype, like EDM, trap, all those stuff, but house music will always stay alive. And if you, if you stay true to that, you will live for the next 40, 50 years. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. Yeah, so I think the next 10 years, whatever happens, house music will stay alive. Do you have any comment? Why, why are you laughing? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's true. What he says, sure. like, you feel it already, we feel it. Also on our label, or uh, all the artists on our label, and they've been releasing a lot of house. And uh, they've been building their platform also, and it's, it's working. So, yeah, he's right. It's definitely, it's, it's, if there's going to be an, another genre in... 10 years is gonna call Frappolo. Garbage. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. House music will always stay alive. That way we saw, I mean, we've been, been in the scene for, I think, almost 15 years. We saw a lot of things changing, happening, but what we um, always saw and experienced that house music, whatever you do, it will stay alive. And that's actually the core of dance music. So whatever hype will come up, house music will, will, will um, will lead the way always. You see yeah. it already with the resistance stage. You know, it's huge. It's a festival on itself already. And they're playing techno all by its house. You they know, call so it techno. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna say it loud and clear. Yeah, yeah. All the techno dudes nowadays, I'm techno, I'm this. No, I wear, no, 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 we're not gonna go there. No, no, I'm gonna go there. <laughs> I'm, we're all in black. I'm only wearing black outfits. Stop it, because it was all house music. Stop that. Thing like on techno, it's house music. No, but yeah. th that's what you can see. The resistance is so huge right now, and it's house. Yeah. It's, so and it's good. People have been loving it. Yeah. You know, we just played the main stage. We came off. Yo, where are you going next? Here we go to resistance. Everyone, you know, a lot of people. So it's it's good. I like it. Yeah. yeah. I, I mean, it got there first, and that's what's good. People get more educated in dance music, and finally worldwide, they're, they're gonna be like gonna be more fun it's not gonna be only one sound on a main stage you're gonna have diverse things happening finally okay. uh, tech house is now very popular yeah what do you think about that and would you like to collaborate with someone I mean I love tech house for me it's you have to forget tech it's just house music mm -hmm. so um, it's big I for, for as far as I know I think it's become very mainstream uh, they don't want to hear that the, the techno scene but I think it's very mainstream and it's good it's not bad I think it's really good they, they work themselves up 
it it's got really big and now it's time to uh, embrace it and and be part of the whole movement don't put yourself in a in a in a corner and like oh we techno and we're not dealing with the rest of dance i mean embrace it and be proud be proud of it and just like like put it out there get it out there and just acknowledge it you know so i think it's a good thing for the scene that there's always like a movement against the mainstream it's always good but i think at this point we came so far with dance music that we have to embrace it and just even even if you think oh it's too commercial i mean you love it it's not because it become commercial you don't love it anymore i loved it when it was underground and i still love it how commercial it is i still love it that's my well, passion yeah, Ten thousand people in one tent it's fucking commercial yeah so yeah you know yeah it's true so tech house yeah, i mean yeah, it was yeah. a good thing it was a great it's a great movement but to call it still tech house i think that's old-fashioned it's dance music and just try to embrace it all and call it dance music so there's no like boundaries in between dance music that's the beauty beauty of house music that you can play whatever you like in a house music set and that's what we're doing for years people are like what style you're playing we're playing house music and that's nowadays techno progressive edm whatever you call it it's house music together because you mix it up and it's all this beat but people want to try to make how, we, it's simple is? It's simple. <laughs> it's simple. But people try to this? but people try to make it difficult <laughs> difficult with how uh, tech uh, tech house with this. Yeah. Well but we play a lot of tech house also. I think uh, when you can call Egbert, you know Egbert? We call him Egbert in Holland. Yeah. It's okay. tech house ish. And we love his tracks. We love his stuff. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For me he is the the best tech house DJ. <laughs> 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 Okay, thank you guys very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so That's much. It?